Los Santos. They say it's the land of opportunity right now. Place you ought to be. Well, that's where me and my brother Bobby Bruce is headed next. You see, we got in a bit of trouble out home that uh, made it hard on us. We had to move out of there. To make things worse, my mom has a uh, form of real bad cancer. I don't know the details about it, but Doc says the treatment's going to be real expensive. So uh, we're going to make some money out here. Best way we can. We'll do anything for him. I will, but uh, I'm a little pissed though leaving uh, Ma with our drunk, no good father. He's just gonna piss away the money she has right now. I hope she's eating good. I'm always thinking about it. But uh, hopefully I find the right people out here. Get into the right uh, form of work. Make some big bucks. More money than I ever had before. And uh, I'm sure she'll be okay. And for Bobby Roos, I know sometimes he thinks I'm wild. But uh, you should trust me more. I'm definitely got a way of things out of you. And uh, sometimes I find better ways to make money than working a 9 to 5, right? So, uh, hopefully he need two pissed about something that involved in hey, Ain't like I'm killing somebody, right? Stealing drugs on the side. What does that even matter, right? Just money. Money for a good cause. Ah, huh, what is it? Hey. Hey, how you doing? I'm doing just fine, huh? How about you? Hey, I, hey not too bad, not too bad. I need you to, I need you to do me a favor if possible. Ah, uh, what's that then, huh? But I need you to open this car door. I seem to be fucking stuck in here. One second, there's baggage in the way here. Let me try to help you out there, huh? You ain't got the keys for this thing? You ain't got the keys for this thing? I got the, I got the rental papers, because it's a rental, but the thing isn't fucking working. Alright. This spot is uh, fucking stuck. Got fucking stuck, I don't know. One second here. Yeah. One second, come on. Come on. There we go. There we go. <laughs> ain't hot wire like this in a long time, I tell you. Come on, here we go. Okay, let's see if I can step out now. Still stuck in the car. What the fuck? Alright, try now. You still stuck? The door broken? Yeah, it doesn't seem like you can get out from any side. Let me get to a parking lot, huh? I'll figure it out. What's your name anyway, since I'm helping you, huh? Hey, I appreciate you, my friend. My name is Joey. What's your name? Nice to meet you, Joey. I'm Frank. Frank Roos. Frank, nice to meet you, Frank. Oh dear, hold on, I'm going over the curve here, fuck it. Hey, there you go, crawl in the front seat, huh? Yeah, I can crawl between the seats, I just can't exit the fucking vehicle. Well, there we fucking go. Oh, it's glad I didn't help you, Joey. Yeah, I appreciate you, my friend. Sorry to pull you away. Uh, uh, no worries. Free. The rental paper's in that car. If you're able to leave it in, take that car, alright? Alright. You just gonna leave it with me? Yes. Yeah, uh, no problem. Feel that's a nice thing. It. I don't owe you nothing, do I? Ain't gonna come bite me in the ass later, is it? Nah, my friend. You are good. You can check the glove box with the uh, flex of your K muscle. You should be able to see the rental papers in there, alright? Sounds good by me. Thanks. Thanks, Joey. Take care. You need to go anywhere? You, you. You're just gonna wait here in the, in the airport? You headed somewhere? Up. Probably run back and rent another car. I don't know about getting in that one. That one freaks me the fuck out, you know. But now it's locked. Try that. And when you get in there, uh, take the rental papers and use them. You should get the keys to the car. All right. All right. Hey, buddy, you all right? You're running around in rain like crazy. Huh? Is that you again, Joey? Hey, yes, me. Oh, um, where are you going then? I'll take you somewhere. No, it's all right. No problem. Hey. Let me pull out of the way this officer here. One second. Okay. Reason we're just in here? Uh, this guy right here is running in the rain, looking crazy. I was going to offer him a ride, you know? Good of uh, good Samaritan, huh? No, that's very nice of you. You realize you got a door 
permits in here on your car, right? Yeah, it's a rental. It is. It was cheap for a reason. All right. It's definitely a little, a little dangerous there. I definitely recommend uh, going to get that fixed here soon. Yeah, you know, when I get the cash, it's uh, it's on the list of things to do, right? Expensive. Uh, I think he's uh, he's trying to get in your car here. Oh. There you go. There you go. All right. You guys be on your way. Drive safe. All right, officer. We'll be safe. Don't worry about it. Alright, let's get going. Alright, have a good one. Y'all yeah, have a good day, thank you. Yeah, I just drew a line on a map in crayon. You think you can take me to that spot? Right turn up here? I'm going ahead and take a left right here for me. Look at those cops are waiting for some trouble back there, huh? Nosy oh, motherfuckers. Definitely. No. You can't trust the fed. You gotta take a right right here at this light. Alright. Hey, if this guy would fucking move his truck! It's raining, it's pissing rain, I got a door open back here! Final fucking leave, right guy? Yeah, yeah. Oh, so Joey, tell me, what brought you here to uh, Los Santos, huh? Yeah, this opportunity, you know. Take a left right here for me. Sorry about that, that was a little too late. That's alright. Oh, the feds are following us. What the hell is this? I think they have to think we're looking good or something like that. Alright, where are we going now? You're gonna keep going straight, or you're gonna turn right up ahead. Alright, right up ahead. It's uh, right, uh, a little bit further down. What the fuck is going on? They just pull up to the side and pull up. Pull up your mouth. What the hell they want right now, huh? You have the rental paper. I got the rental papers on me. This is wasting my goddamn time. I get here for a new place already. I'm being fucking harassed by somebody, right? God damn it, Joey. They wait at the door and they're gonna say something about the door, I bet. They're gonna be like, oh, you should get the door fixed. I already know I can get the door fixed. They already told me to get the door fixed. Hi there. What can I do for you, ma'am? Huh? If your license and registration, sir? I do. One second. All right, let me, let me just turn this thing off real quick, huh? I don't wanna waste gas. Usually is a good idea to turn your vehicle off when we're pulling you over. There you go. Is that happy? So what's what's the meaning of this pullover? Huh? What did I do? Is it because of the door or something? Gus, would you like to inform him? You ran a red light back there when you turned uh, left. I was green on me. It was already in the middle of the road. Cause if it's in the middle of the road, it ain't legal yet. No, sir. You ran you ran a red light back there. I, I I'm pretty sure it was green. It was green when I Look got right there, it was green when I turned. I don't try to break laws when I just get to a new fucking place, you know? I'm I sorry, I'm a little I'm a little irate. Right. I mean, still here, sir. Let me just pause. Hey, yeah, you can lower your you can lower your tone. Yeah. We're, we're just checking on you because you know you went through the red light. I know we'd already just seen you back there, but it's already difficult that you're you're missing a door here that's kinda not really safe. But now you're running red lights, so we're just trying to make sure you understand the street laws. No, I know the street laws. I know how it works. I don't know about you, but when I looked at it, it was green. Maybe, maybe it turned right when I when I was turning or something. I didn't see it turn red. What's his name, Marco? What right in the system? Um, I'm sorry. It was Frank, I think. Frank Roos. Frank Roos. How do you spell that? Just R double O S. R U S E. Are you Frank, if you'd like, you can um, you can sit back in your car so you're not standing here in the rain. I appreciate that. It's fucking pissing. Of course. No worries. Did I run a red light? I'm pretty sure I did run a red light. Back he there. told me it was a red light, so... Not gonna lie, like you said, it's raining pretty hard out here, so it's possible that, you know, light colors are reflecting off the rain, and... And Either maybe, of us could have mistaken it, you know what I mean? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was, uh, pretty sure it was green, but, uh, you know, it's not a big deal. You know, at the end of the day, uh, just check it, make sure everything's legit, and, uh, you know, we know that you're just doing your job. We're not, uh, we're not stressing out about nothing, you know what I mean? No, I, I apologize for the tone. You know, I, I get irate easily. 
It's, uh, it's pissing rain, it's wet, it's cold, and I'm messing a door on this car. Some, uh, some asshole you know, took it off early today at the airport, so right, it's, so it's a new thing. You got your uh, rental papers here? I do. Do I need to get out to show you those? Uh, handed those to me. Yeah. Yeah, sorry about that. I forgot to ask for those. All right. All right. Yeah, that all uh, seems like it checks out to me. Make and sure you get that there. door fixed. Yeah, I will. I'm just gonna issue you a warning for that uh, running that red light. Make sure you make sure make sure you uh, are positive that they are green before you get there next time. All right, we'll do. Okay. And get that door fixed, or I'm gonna I have know. to impound your car. Hey, you should look for uh, you should look for a minivan, black, stuffed with white paint, and you know pull them over and tell them you know maybe she didn't knock doors off and they're parked in front of a goddamn airport. I'll keep my eyes on for it, sir. All right, we're low on gas. Okay, uh, all right, you said stop sign. Yeah, there should be a gas station on the way. that they were wasting my time. They were poking at me. They were looking for something, huh? They were pissed about the door. Makes no fucking sense. What we're trying to do is get out of the fucking range, get to a new fucking car, you know. They just gotta fucking test everybody. Yeah, nosy motherfuckers. That's what they are. You see that? Red light. They drove on a goddamn red light, huh? Fucking morons. We might as well wait just in case. You never know when a fuck's coming around the corner, right? Well, anyways, Joey, I appreciate you helping me out, and I'm helping you out. You know what? Hey, I, I, I appreciate you as well, Hey, you gotta be my new friend here in town, right? I gotta make a friend somewhere. That's what my uh, brother says. That's what my mom says. Yeah, I always recommend, uh... Uh, grabbing a phone. You know where to buy a phone at? I hate cell phones. Oh, you're not gonna use one? I, I, I'm gonna use one, but I fucking hate them. I'll have to write down your number somewhere on a piece of paper, huh? Yeah, I have a phone on me. You can, uh, you can write it down whenever, uh, whenever we get to the spot. That way you can give me a call tomorrow because today it's cell phone now is not really working in the city, so you'll have to wait till tomorrow. Alright. Got a job here yet? Yeah, I worked at the... I was writing back and forth with one of the mechanics in the city and I worked at the, the south side mechanic shop. You think you uh, induced me, maybe? Yeah, sure, why not? They have a they have a manager uh, named Randy. I think uh, he'll be doing interviews, so uh, that definitely be something uh, we can do. We can have you meet him uh, and see if you can uh, get a job there because they'll be doing in person interviews soon. Uh, what are, what's the word? Uh, fuck it. They're not open today. Uh, none of them. Like, none of the real business. Yeah, I know what you mean. It's it's a fucking uh, fucking storm today. I bet things are flooded. You need to, where, where do I go from here, huh? Right, turn. I want to take a lift right here. Actually. Sorry about that. It's actually that little parking lot right there, where it says Caesars. You see right there? Yeah, I see. I see it. Let me uh, let me back up again to the other lane, huh? That sounds good. I'll see anybody coming up behind. They're big cities, what I hate about them is they ain't make no fucking sense wherever you go. They always mess. It's a mess everywhere. Now you're welcome, Joey. Anytime, anytime, man. I'll see you around, okay? Uh, east Side Customs or South Side, what you say it was? It's South Side, yeah. South Side. The name is, uh... Uh, nuts and tires and nuts or something like that. Alright, tires and nuts, something like that, south side. Alright, I'll make sure I check yeah. it out. I'll see you there another day. You, you stay safe, watch out for them fucking uh, feds. They're gonna mess with people like us, you know? They don't like they don't like the way we sound. Fucking yeah, prejudiced. That's right. That's right, exactly. Right, you be safe.
Hey, you take care. Hey, buddy, you know the I'm casino's going. open? No, the casino's not fucking open. I can't, I can't gamble. I can't find a fucking judge to take the bar or anything. I'm, I'm fucking dying over here. Yeah, it seems like this town's full of crap right now. I've been all over the place. Ain't no one hiring. Ain't no one doing shit. And the I cops are nosy, to too. I don't know where the fuck to find uh, anyone from the Department of Justice, if there even fucking is one. The courthouse is barren. Yeah, maybe they are uh, on hiatus, on uh, vacation right now. Uh... What's I don't your even name? Wanna, uh, Eli, you, you need my full, here's my full legal. Hold on, this is my full legal. Oh, Eli, vagrant. I'm uh, Frank Roos, nice to meet you. Yeah. So you're starting to be a lawman, huh? You, uh, I'd like to be a lawyer. I'd like to. I want to do criminal defense in the business stuff. Yeah, criminal defense. That pay well. What? That pay well. I would imagine, yeah. I ain't never done it myself. And then again, I ain't got no lawyer degree. I damn can see what's going on. Yeah, that's what I want to get my, my, my big old lawyer degree. Well, you might have luck later tomorrow or something like that. It seems Man, like, I don't uh, want to do all that shit. I want to do it now. Government seems to be uh, in, in a fucking fuss right now here in town. I guess it happened, uh, some shit happened yesterday or something that made everyone on edge. Uh, it's annoying. It's just, uh, it's just inconveniencing me, the little guy. Uh, you ain't dressed so little, so uh, you got that going at least. You know how to these... dress, you know how to look the part. It's important these days. You look the part, you get the part. That's what I hear. Yeah, I guess. Pants at 30 years old. Hey, you should probably get some new pants then. They're good pants. Yeah, but I see holes in them right there on the side now. You pointed out, I see the holes. Why are you lying? No, right there, right there. Next to the seam nah, on the side right nah, there. Nah, no. It's, 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 I don't believe you. I refuse. You, you can refuse it, but it's, it's clear as day, daylight. You got a hole in your pants. I don't have like a fucking hole in my pants, buddy, alright? Alright, you ain't got no hole in your pants. What I fucking thought. Yeah, but you do. So, uh. I don't, though. Yeah, you keep telling yourself that. But, uh. Hey, you look the part. Maybe if they don't look down, then they won't worry about your 30 year old pants. Ugh. Well, I gotta get going. It's pissing rain, anyways. I'm gonna find a place yeah, to um, get a drink. I, I need to locate the nearest person that gives a fuck. Hey, Bob, good look in this town. Ain't hey, no one give a fuck around here. Doing that fella. Hey, you know, you know a guy named Joey by the chance. What the fuck? Shit! <laughs> Looks like someone pushed a car off the roof or something. What the hell? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's me. You look like him. I, I just had to you for a couple of days. Hey, you better watch out. You better watch out. The, the car's gonna flip. I, I, run away. How you doing, Joey? You're just so nice. You, I, w w you're part of over there. You don't mind me asking. Hey, what's going on? What's up? Are you, uh, you part of a uh, business or something? Uh, I just have some, uh, some friends over here. I appreciate that. I would. My name's uh, Frank Roos. Frank Roos, right? Yeah. I felt that was your name, but I didn't want to. didn't want to get it wrong. No, we only had such a short interaction, you know, the other day. Uh, and then you don't have yeah. the car. We is uh order for you. Everybody okay? Yeah, I think everything's okay. Hey, Gio. Yeah. Here. Hey, this is uh this is Frank. Uh, I met him by the airport. He seems yeah, like a pretty stand-up guy. He gave me a ride back when I uh when I lost my car. Just in case. Yeah, he got stuck inside a car there for a second. Nobody helped him out. Um, That's why I lended him a hand. Just whenever you guys want to you know, get a car or anything, I'll leave like in front of him. Yeah, he was, I see, uh, I see. You ready? Yeah, nice he to was meet asking you. me uh he was asking me about you guys. Said he would like to be introduced. Seems like a stand-up businessman, so I figured I'd introduce him. 
Okay. You know, he's following all the laws when we were driving. Riding. Let's tell him, you can run that red light, you know. He was like, no, I'm not gonna do that. Number is <laughs> seven, eight, seven, K, seven, right. nine, nine. My name's uh, Frank Roos, nice to meet you. Frank Roos, nice to meet you. Uh, my name's Giovanni, everyone calls me Gio. This here to my left is my brother Marcelo. And the dumbass over there that's still talking to EMS is my other brother, Nicky. Hey, boom. Nice to meet you, Nicky. Gio, nice Marcelo. So, uh, what do you like to do in the city, Frank? No, I'm trying to find my way right, uh, my way right now. Me and my brother, uh, Bobby, uh, Roos, were moving here recently to uh, pay for some bills. There's opportunity here, and uh, right now things are going slow, and I'm trying to find my direction. I see, I see. Um, where, uh, where are you coming from? Uh, Liberty City. Ah, oh, fellow Liberty man, what fun. Uh, and just the backwater place, nothing special. Oh, I got you, I got you. We hail from Little Italy. Yeah, I've if seen it before. It's nice, good food there. really obvious. <laughs> I figured, you know, the accent and everything, yeah. dressed so nice. Yeah, yeah. You get those few Italians who move out of the joint, but uh, the neighborhood's still still there. Yeah, my uh, uh, my mom grew up there, but uh, I didn't. Yeah, I see, I see. So, um... Uh, Joseph, I see you're uh, you're out making friends. This is like the third person you've introduced me to. Yeah, I told you that one day I was uh, just driving around looking for you guys. I probably talked to like 15 people, you know. Jesus Christ. Yeah, it was just I see people on the road. You want to ride? That's it, you know. What? Why? Is somebody but fucking on the damn right? roof? Yeah, I think it's one of our friends. Although one of our friends, Joey, go check it out. Yeah. Sure? Sounds like somebody's uh, eavesdropping. If they, uh, if they is. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't really appreciate it. That's yeah, rude. Oh, by the way, it's a bug. I mean, I don't really have much to, to, to offer you in terms of work. You know, normally this would be the pod that I would, uh, I, I would offer you a job at our cafe, but the shit's not even open yet. No, I understand. Uh, uh, Joey's just, you know, I, I need to make friends in this town, right? You can get, yeah, friends get yeah. you places. And uh, I met Joey the other day. He was nice. I appreciated helping him out, and he helped me out as well. He gave me his rental car, and uh, that made a big difference in my day. Especially since it was pissing rain all day. Yeah, you can never have too many friends. Exactly. And I ain't nobody out here. I ain't know anyone, and I'm just getting myself started. And my brother's moving out here soon. See, uh, my mom, she's real sick with cancer, and uh, we're trying to make some money to pay for her uh, experimental oh, treatments. That I, I understand. Uh, our, our father just passed two months ago with cancer. <sighs> now, if I could physically rustle cancer out of her and beat the shit out of it, I would. I felt you did. But unfortunately, I'm not the thinking where my brother is, so he's uh, he's making the big plans to uh, for us to make the money. But I'm just trying to, you know, get us an apartment uh, situated down here, get things figured out. Well, I hate to be the one to tell you, but I don't think they've uh, set up the apartment system yet. It's really just a like one motel that's up in Vinewood that you can really stay in. Yeah. As far as I know, anyway. Um, Joey. Who uh? Who, who had the common courtesy to eavesdrop upon a uh, conversation with my new friend here? She didn't say a word to me. She just kept trying to play like bring around the rosy around the vents and then jumped off the other side and fell face flat on her face. Nikki. And then got up and ran. You've got to be kidding me. Nikki. Jesus Christ. Hello, Nikki. Good morning. Earth the fucking sunshine over there. Marcelo, go with Joey. God, Jesus. Gotcha. Christ. Oh, you want to go check it out? Yes. She's probably long gone by now. She ran across the street as fast as she could afterwards. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, if you need that. Uh... I anything like that. I think it was just uh, some random girl. What the fuck is Nikki doing? He ate you. Hey. She's probably long gone by now. She was sprinting from the moment she got it. She got off the ground. Oh, I see. I see. Was a girl with like uh, long white hair? Yeah. That's yeah. Exactly the one. You know, Dressed I in all said, white. You know, she was standing over here behind us earlier when the EMS was here. She was just sort of standing there, oh, looking yeah, at us, and then she went over. Uh, I seen no it too. Idea. She ran around the corner that way uh, when I was under the car, and then went on. Sort of that well, way. Then let's like go that. look for our new friend, boys. Come on. I can lend a hand if you want. Yeah, show up.
After this, I'll give you my number. If you need me for anything, you call me up. Of course. So, Dio, you say you're running a, a cafe out here? Yeah, it's gonna be called Cafe Coretta. It's gonna be opening up in Vespucci once we actually buy the property. Where it might be a minute, though. You guys gonna sell drinks there as well? Yeah, of course. Yeah, I have to find myself there some, the, some of the finest Italian imported wine. I like wine. I don't know, I met these ladies the other day. Four of them, they're all hitting on me and stuff, so I think I have to invite all four of them out sometime. See which one wants to be my girlfriend. Maybe they all want to be my girlfriend. I like that. <laughs> I like that, pal. Yeah. You know, I'm trying to find my place here in this town, and uh, there's a lot of places here I don't want to find out where I'm going to spend my time and my money when I'm not working. Yeah, of course, of course. Well, that's a shame. No, she mentioned she was working at a, uh, what's it called? Uh, a uh, mechanic shop. That was nearby. Oh, mechanic shop. Yeah, the two la the ladies that were next to each other, I think they knew each other. Girl with purple hair, girl with white hair. It's thing about a mechanic shop. Oh, oh, he's talking about the other Russian. Oh, no, 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 no. There, there's the, uh... There's another girl that was on top of a roof that we're looking for. She's got long white hair that we're out looking for. Oh, there was two white hair ladies then, huh? Yeah. Oh, are we looking for her? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh yeah, uh, I, did, I, I didn't really appreciate being eavesdropped on. You know how I feel about that, Nikki. Wait, who was eavesdropping? She was standing on top of the roof while we were having a nice conversation with our new friend here. If you ask me, that's real suspicious. Like, they, uh, they know something about something. Is that better? Okay, yeah, yeah, this is much better. Yup, yeah, it's Nikki. Alright. Where's Nikki at? Can you pass us? No, he's uh, he's to he's to your right. Nikki's the guy who was having uh, head problems. Just go ahead and uh, continue on to the airport. Oh, I feel so much better. Uh, we have to take a while to turn around, unfortunately, but yeah, uh, we'll do don't, it. Yeah, don't worry about it. I like the view. I haven't been on this bridge yet. I saw him driving in, but it's nice to get a bird's eye view of the city. Yeah, it's beautiful. A lot of lights. Yeah. Reminds me of home a little bit. It does. It reminds me of Liberty. So where's your family from? Uh, Liberty City. You just said Liberty City. No, I know, I know Liberty City, but like... Oh, original. Liberty. Uh, my mom's Italian, my dad's Italian as well, so that makes me Italian, I guess. But I don't speak oh. the language, unfortunately. It's a, uh... It's not a well... It's not a known language in America these days, especially in the larger cities, unfortunately. God bless my mother. She did try, but uh, unfortunately, I was into different things when I was younger, and uh, I yeah. was at home a lot because of that. She would uh, worry you know, about did, me. I did pick up a little bit on the on the uh, of an accent there. I'm not gonna lie. I've, I've been picking up a little bit on it. It's the Liberty it's, City, uh, it's... New Yorker accent, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so you, we gotta talk to Joey because. If, if, if he's gonna be the lead car, he can't go speeding off. He has to make sure that he's where behind him. Oh, thank you for being the lead car. Yeah, thank you for being the lead car. Oh, you speed off or anything. And he doesn't even know he's doing wrong. I jumped the fence, is that what it was? If you're being the lead car, you have to make sure that we're behind you. Trouble. Well, Nikki was having car trouble, I should say. But our new friend Frank here came in to uh, came in to, to save the day. Thank you, there, pal. Thank you, Frank. Uh, no worries. You're welcome. Hi, hey, 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 just like the rest of us. What a surprise. A small world, right? Mm-hmm. Real small world. But it's always yeah, good she... to have. It's always good to know fellow Italians. A lot of people coming over from the East Coast recently. Uh, rumor is gold mine out here, but everything's super fucking expensive, so I don't see it. Yeah, yet. I know. Everybody's fucking talking about, though, it's the fucking land of opportunity. The city is the place to be. There's so much thing. Yeah, we all come over and then everything's fucking high marked up price and then you fucking earn bupkis. I went to this place Jesus called Head House. $110 for a piss wasser. At the gas station, Sorry, I bought what? it for two bucks. Get this, get this. 
to I'm rent a car is 200 bucks. I mean, that's not that expensive. Now, cars that's are kind of cheap here for, for you know, you know low-end cars, but uh, I mean, some well, yeah, cars are 25 like, grand. You can't, normally, you can turn a rental car back in to fucking, you know, get some, get some of your cash back for it. But this one, you, yeah, you fucking, it's like you're keeping it forever. You want me driving again? Yeah, I heard no, about this right. place. What, it was the fucking riots. Nice to see at least the airport recovered. I mean, yeah, uh, from what I've been able to tell. What the fuck? National Security? Jesus Christ. Okay, that's an office. Um, from what I've been able to tell, the, uh, the place has kind of been uh, kind of been cleared up. You know? Uh, just follow the lead car, by the way, Frank. He'll, he'll uh, I take us I cleaned up, and I'll believe that when I see South Side or whatever they call it. Uh, well, to be fair, actually, South Side's not as bad as you'd expect. Um, it's, uh, you know, it's got a lot more vegetation than it used to, that's for sure. Really? You, you're you not gonna tell me that it's better than Liberty? Eh, well, eh. Liberty, it's debatable, depending on which part of the city you're in. Well, I mean, after that whole kerfuffle It's that sunny. Went down. Like, look, this is south side right here. Look at it. Huh. Mm. It smells Less like shit on the side of the building town, in my opinion. Fire. Well, the smell's a different story. I think that's what they call the projects over there, isn't it? Oh, yeah, one thing you do gotta, you don't gotta really worry about, Frank. Is that if you have it in a three-person uh, convoy with us, okay? If the cops ever show up, depending on where the cop is located, one of them pulls over, either the lead car or the rear car. So you don't really gotta worry about getting pulled over, pal. These uh, cops are pretty nosy. Has Joey told you that yet? Yeah. Well, yeah, they are pretty nosy. But there is one who's actually not that bad. An officer Deluca. Uh, uh, what? What the fuck was his name? It wasn't Deluca. It was uh, Delgado. That's right. An officer Delgado, he seems he seems like good people, but uh, the rest of them? Jesus Christ, don't even fucking get me started. I got pulled over for having a door off the car that uh, was a rental. I said some uh, asshole headed off, and uh, you know, he's like, you need to go repair that right now. I was like, well, you want me to go pay for it right now? I got bills to pay, I got things to do. You know, this, this is a uh, expense I have to get to. You want me to do it right now, huh? And he was all like, well, maybe when you get a chance to do it. And he was a real asshole about it. Jesus Christ. Oh, it's a fucking car, but what do you expect? Hey, phone hey, uh, uh, go to the uh, repair shop first. I want to repair this car. All right, grazie, ciao. All right, fellas. Are, are, aren't those idiots cost you an arm and a leg in these days? Uh, not if you siphon it. Wait, you siphon it? Long you story. Can do that? Yeah, I'll tell you how to do it later. Mm, all right. I love committing fraud. I'm well, sorry. Hey, 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 hey. We're not committing fraud. We are just exercising our right to freedom of speech through different means. Yeah, of course. Protected under the uh, First Amendment. First Amendment. Where the fuck is he going? I know my I told him. Oh my oh. good boy. Wrong turn, dumbass! Jeez, Frank, you know how to work a car, don't you? Yeah, these ones are a little slidey, though, to what I'm used to. Yeah, that's true. You remind me of my papa. He used to race back in the day. The old car. Yeah, I've seen those. Those are nice. I've seen pictures inside uh, old restaurants. You know, you know, diners and things. I've seen those old cars. Yeah, they were literally just boxes. Sometimes you had to get a run and start on them, right? Huh? You had to wind them up with a run and start sometimes, right? Exactly. You didn't even get a windshield or anything. Oh, let me, uh, let me go This around. is a luxury. Uh, Frank, just, uh, pull up, pull up a little bit next to his other one, real quick. Uh, we're gonna be, uh, moving the car probably to the garage anyway. Jesus, you're all dressed so nicely, I gotta, I, I think I gotta get off my coat. What way to smoke is that, John? Smoke. Just normal? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Wow. I gotta change this. Are you mean you're yeah, done thinking? You always put the rest. Are you, are you not? Well, just let me know. I yeah. The keys to my car. Well, that's what we're gonna be all doing. In a minute. Oh, I gotcha. You know, I get the ice cream with it. I mean, I like fashion, but I also like Sinatra. 
depends what the mood, what type of mood it is. You talking to me? Hey, so Frank. Yeah. You got any friends? There we go. Nah, he didn't tell me. Of course he's yet. got friends. He's got us. <laughs> yeah, I got oh, some new friends. Right. You're right. I made some new friends. Yeah. Besides us. Yeah, well, besides you guys, I met Joey. And then uh, I met oh, this guy. I met this loyal boy. guy named Eli. I kind of like him, but he's kind of an asshole. Oh, Elena, hey. Oh, yeah, yeah. We're uh, we're pairing a car down in Mira Park, and we'll be there soon. All right. You good? All right. Ciao. Well, as I was saying, all I got right now is my brother. Uh, let me get you. I don't know where that is. Uh, I got you. I got you. I, I'm, I'm, I'm interested to meet you, brother. He's a smart guy. His name is uh, Bobby Roos. He's a, uh, no, he's a, he's a, he's a good man. He's a good family. He's a, uh, he's the morality I guess of the two of us. He knows when to think. He knows when to stop. I just, I keep on going sometimes. Oh, shit, the guy's been the same your way. So maybe, maybe, yeah, yeah. I, was, I was about to say, it's not really that difficult. Yeah, they, Listen, I rock the Luigi style. I, I, I got my stupid The oh, fucking my Luigi style? style? That's what we're hey, calling what it I, now? Okay, all right. I had to call it something, all right? Yeah, 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 yeah. What, what do you want to call it? The fucking suit pants, formal shirt, leather jacket style? That's a fucking mouthful. I was just going to say liberty. All right, you know what? You have a fair point there. It's totally See, there style. you go. There but, you go. You know, one thing I learned from you is that you dress to impress. You know, the way you look is important to people. Exactly. No matter what no one Listen, says, can... you dress good for the occasion. Uh, I can just throw on a tie. I can just throw on a tie and a nice jacket, and I'm ready for the ball, see? I'm going to change my shoes a bit, but that don't matter too much. Hey Marcelo, can you uh, take the car behind me and like park it like uh, at the next door or like on the road so that way they can move the car into the mechanic shop when it yeah, comes yeah. time. Thanks. Why didn't I come back? Yeah, right, right. I, I, I want to show Frank around. You know, he's, uh, he's, uh, he's, uh, he's, uh, he's, uh, he's a new friend. I appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, no problem, pal. I can tell right now you guys have a lot of history. Yeah, we're uh, we're a lively bunch. So it's just wait till you hear us start arguing. Oh yeah, that no correction. Wait till you hear them start arguing and me start arguing because they're arguing. And then me defending him. <laughs> As long as you guys are very lively indeed, huh? That's great. You That's know where she is? Uh, she's at home. Oh, she's at home. Yeah. Okay. I forgot about that. Yeah, you're right. You don't mind me asking. Uh, it's too forward. What's bringing you boys uh, to uh, Los Santos, anyways, besides your restaurant? Well, like you know, like we said, this is the, everyone's telling us this is the land of opportunity. I'll take it right here. Take it right here. Take I know. Right I was here. lowering them. Okay. Uh, um, this is like the land of uh, opportunity, as I'm saying. You know, it's the great big next thing that's gonna happen, and then you know, so. Not only did we see opportunity in terms of the uh, the restaurant, but you know, a lot of us were blood family, we're brothers and we're sisters, and for the longest time, we've been spread out. We haven't really been around each other. So unfortunately, our father passed away two months ago, and rest his soul. I've re God rest his soul indeed. Um, and me being the oldest, I decided I need to take up as head of the household. So I made the decision that I'm, I'm gonna move everybody out here to LS so we can finally be a family again. That's a good reason, that's a good reason right there. I commend that. Family is real important. It's all you have in this world. That it is. Still reason. Frank? Yeah? What's your reason? I need to uh, make money. An you know, opportunity like you guys, right? But uh, my ma, she's uh, real sick of cancer. Money, I need to think real quick. Oh my, my apologies. Jesus. Sorry, I got a text message. We need to go up Vitale at the airport sometime. What? Vitale? I don't know how to fucking pronounce his name. Vitale? Vitale? Yeah, Vitale. 
it's not Vitaly, it's Vitaly. Vitaly, yeah. Oh my god, you, you definitely need to start working on your fucking Italian. Jeez. I'm sorry, I've been, I've been in America too long. I can tell. Also, I left Italy when I was fucking 11. You left there when you were 12. It's one year, Nikki. Oh yeah, well, one year makes a lot of difference to you, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This place is really nice. Thank you. Go and open the door for her, Nikki. Dang. The wrong door. There you go. Hi. Hi, Elena. How you doing, miss? Good, how are you? Elena, this is our, uh, our new friend, uh, Mr. Frank. Frank? Hello, Frank. This is Elena. Nice to meet you, Elena. She's, uh, somebody very close to me. Folks got a big family, you know, that's good to have. You know, my family keeps shrinking, and, you know, it's like, you know, one person gets sick and then they go on, it's just been a bad uh, couple years for us. It happens. It definitely does happen. That's why I always say cherish the times that you have with the ones that you love. Yeah, I keep those uh, times I have close to me. Uh, what I was saying earlier, but uh, I'm not going to repeat it again if I get interrupted, though, because it's, it's a touchy subject. Because you were asking me. My mom, she's got cancer. It's terminal, but uh, there's an experimental um, you know, medicine that I've uh, opted into, but it's cost a lot of money. So that's why I'm here. She's still in Liberty City of my father. But he's a good for nothing drunk sometimes, so he's trying, but he ain't the best. I'm sorry to hear about your mom. Yeah, thank you. But, uh, yeah. Last time I bought a car, I was the last one to get one before, it, you know, the manufacturer broke down, but they may have fixed it by now. They might have. No. No, it is not. No, no, no. Do not tell them the with me as well, Luigi, Frank, and uh, Nikki, we're in the second row. Okay, okay. We're gonna go pick up a blessing at the gas station right near the hospital. Where they say we're going? Jesus Christ. I did. So I'm meeting a lot of people. Who, who am I in the car with right now? Luigi. Luigi. Luigi got brown jacket. I'm in the back. We picked you up from there. Yeah, I'm Nicholas. I'm Nicholas. All right, Nicholas and Luigi. Good to meet you guys. Yeah, I'm the I'm second oldest. Second oldest. All right. Well, I, I'm happy that uh, your brother brought you guys up together. It's always good to have family close by. That's He's going to say what's up with I really, It's all I really about family. Him. I brought him here. Yeah, you didn't try to make out all my siblings tell my uh, mom that I didn't engage, but I really did. Where's that? Where's Wait, Joey? Your the tree? Tell? What? Oh, Joey doesn't fit in our tree at all. He's, uh, you know, a friend. Oh, a friend. I'm glad I met him, because he's, uh, he's a good guy. And, uh, yeah. No, I always need new friends myself. I'm, uh, I ain't know nobody out here, like I said. And, uh, you know, I, it's gonna make life easier here if I got someone to go drink and shoot the shit with, watch sports, you know? What are you? What are you doing? What? Okay. Jesus Christ! See the clutch the fuck. Why is Elise here? What's you guys' family name, by the way? I only heard the first names. Um, it's not something we share a lot. Um, I'll let my brother tell you. I know. I, I, if you no, know, if anything is me prying too much, you know, just tell me to stop. It's fine. I'm not. Yeah, uh, it's okay. I don't mean to uh, put my nose where it ain't belong. You know. Yeah, it's fine. 
Did you say your family's Italian? Yeah. Um, my mom and my dad are Italian. And, uh, they grew up in the Liberty City, but uh, they moved to another part of town. And uh, they tried teaching me uh, Italian, but never stuck. But, uh, kind of a poor small family. One day out and visit Italy. That'd be nice. Get out of the fucking yeah. states for once in my life. Folks have a real they lovely were. home, by the way. I've never seen anything so nice in my life. You know, it, Thank you. it's not officially ours yet, but we call it home. If you stay in there, it's home, right? It's where you lay your head. Yeah, I mean, Scotland is right to this, right? Yeah. Another thing that makes this place a gold mine, there's a lot of properties up for grabs right now. Just because of uh, people moving out of town during the gang wars. Yeah, I mean, I'm not one to buy property down with a with a line, Hello. you know. Yeah, what's up? Uh, I don't know. He, started, he said that we were heading back home. Is that not where we're going? Yeah, I'm not really home. sure. He just started driving. Where are we going? Uh, I think he's driving. I think he's just taking the long way. And we find probably. Uh, that was you know, Gio, he just called. Okay, you know, my, my, my whole set thingy about it, right, is there's a line that splits the uncivilized from the civilized, you know what I mean? It's how they dress, mostly. It's how I say it. Not how they dress, it's how they act, their morals, their ethics. You know, certain people have morals, ethics, Codes of honor, you know? But as soon as you get to that part of the city, there's just no honor, there's no ethics, there's no codes. It's just... It's... It's the line that separates the good from the evil. You know? I'm sorry, are you being racist right now? No, not at all. I don't know, can I... I'm so a certain referee. Nope. Luigi? I'm just pulling your leg, don't worry. A lot of people in this town are self-serving. They only care about themselves and they can gain with their hands on in the short time. Exactly. We still made it here for the area. This place is stunning, it's beautiful. Yeah. Wait till you see the back. 